Hey folks, welcome back to another uh, just little oil painting update. This time I've done uh, uh, something a little Francis Bacon-like uh, with Leatherface here. Um, it's kind of based on one of his uh, paintings, which was just of a blue guy just, you know, standing in front of uh, two, uh, you know, meat cow carcasses behind him. Uh, just kind of came up with this little thing. Um, I know I wanted to do something with Leatherface, so, um, you know, I just kind of thought of, uh, you know, two and two together, and uh, this came out. So, uh, I think it looks pretty, uh, pretty okay for what it is now, but I'm just glad it's done. Cause, uh, I don't know. Uh, I tried just a couple things for uh, a background, but it just wasn't coming out, so uh, I guess to be just like that certain Francis Bacon painting and that certain uh, feeling just, you know, just wanted to do a black background anyway. So it's kind of how I imagined it anyway, but I just wanted, you know, different choices. So I mean, it's good for what it is. Um, uh, yeah, especially painting on this scale is kind of difficult. Uh, I wish I had um, done this on a bigger canvas, but, uh, you know, what are you going to do? And I wanted to see if I could do it, but well, this is what came out of it, and I think it's okay for what it is. Um, maybe some work can be done here and there, but well, anyway, the, yeah, I, I enjoy this incarnation of Leatherface, and you know, I enjoy the remake, of course, and it's pretty cool. So I hadn't done this Leatherface yet, so I just figure, you know, it's gonna be a good way to do it. And just for some ad symbolism, supposedly as well. Uh, it could be like these carcasses could re represent angel wings, so to speak. Well, maybe Leatherface is just an angel of death. And speaking of which, uh, it's kind of not out of left field either, since this is from. Uh, kind of reminded of that scene from the remake where uh, it's chasing uh, one of the main characters through a slaughterhouse and going through this maze of these carcasses behind him. And I figure, oh, okay, so it's, you know, it's pretty canon. Not too bad, either. So it's not something for uh, just something artistically, exclusively, anyway. So, yeah. Uh, I kind of glossed over this with uh, Fixative, and I don't think it's... Um, that dry now. I had to go over it a few times because the paint was, you know, pretty wet still. I mean, I just did this like last night, so. Um, but oh, when it dries, I mean, uh, I think it looks okay. Yeah, I definitely had to change some things. Like, uh, Leatherface's mask was too dark, so this is really the lightest it can be now. Yeah. Well, maybe some changes could be made, but well, anyway, just wanted to uh, you know show this off since it's you know uh, the latest I've done so far. So anyway, uh, thank you all for watching. Uh, hope you enjoyed this video, and uh, see you later. Take care. Thanks for watching.